Well, I am so glad you started there because I think many of our viewers and many people at CBC don't know 42,000, don't, don't, don't know 1,900 stores, don't know 20 million people in the Neighbors Loyalty Club. These are extraordinary numbers, Hal, for a company that people don't really know about. Yeah, it's quite the hidden gem, uh, Jim. You know, we don't have a store within a, uh, you know, an hour's drive in New York City or Los Angeles. And so at times uh, we can get overlooked. But, uh, you know, we've got, as you said, we're nearing 2,000 stores, uh, rolling 12 uh, revenues uh, over $11 billion, uh, rolling 12 comp growth rates are over 30 percent, 42,000 plus team members, 20 million members of our Neighbors Club, uh, you know, we really focus on serving that rural out here lifestyle. All right. Well, one of the things, Hal, that I think is important, I switched to tractor supply from my local uh, feed and grain. I don't think that's unusual for rural. But then there's another whole group who are coming, millennials, who are going from urban to suburban and rural. Both trends are very powerful. Yeah, as you said, Jim, we've been getting market share with our core customer, but also with a new customer and the millennial customer. You know, we all look at the mobility date and we're seeing millennials move out of the city, out into the suburbia and out into rural. We're really seeing a revitalization of, of rural led by millennials. They're leading in home purchases out in rural areas and they're also forming households. They're adopting pets and they're really inspired by the out here lifestyle. We saw a four point sales penetration change last quarter with the millennial cohort. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at CNBC.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.